right, folks. Uh, <clears throat> some little pentatonic flurries there, okay? So, um, I was in B minor, just playing the old uh, pentatonic scale, which would be what, 7, 10. Seven ten, seven nine, seven nine, seven nine, seven nine, or seven ten, seven ten. Okay, but to get these little flurries, I'm just doubling. I'm just, I'm really just playing the scale all in a row, uh, uh, in order. You know, but what I'm doing is, I'm just doing uh, instead of two notes, I'm making it four notes. So. In other words, if I'm on the sixth string and I got seven and ten, I just go seven, ten, seven, ten. You know, with the down, up, down, up. That way, every time you go to a new string, you got a down, up, down, up, down, up. Wherever you go, it's going to be a down, up. Okay, so what I did is I just traveled, you know, I was playing some licks first. some B minor and then once in a while I'll throw in the flurry. Okay, I can do them all in a row, mix them up, do a couple on the third string, you know, second string, maybe, you know, do them backwards where you're going to be, you can start with the higher note on the string, like for instance on the first string, pinky at 10, okay, and then index at 7. Okay, and I'm just doubling it. Jump down to five. Get a little tail note, you know, a little tail on it. And then back to seven for the B, okay? So just little pentatonic flurries. With the most basic principle, just repeating the notes twice. Like you're practicing the scale, like... Okay, but just do each one twice. Maybe shoot to the uh, 12th fret, just to break it up, and then come back down, okay? that one tubers uh little pentatonic flurries in b minor okay so <laughs> riffs unlimited the endless riffer all right hasta luego